in a plain and simple language to design is to provide a solution for a particular need not any solution the most creative and the most innovative solution for a specific need drawing skills is one uh, area where we would i would like to see people you know having really good draw drawing skills or a potential to develop on those particular skills um, a very keen observation and a penchant for you know finding solutions to problems if you don't have that kind of a passion then it will be difficult to get into this particular field but on a very serious note uh, for students who are let us say in the 9th and 10th uh, standards uh, they would actually have to opt to take the science stream uh, at least to get into colleges uh, which take undergraduate or provide undergraduate courses in design uh, specifically uh, science stream because there are a lot of technical inputs which would be given to the students later on whether it is on the undergraduate level or even in the postgraduate level the number of colleges which are giving undergraduate courses are for example national institute of design in ahmedabad we have iit uh, delhi iit guwahati and very recently iit mumbai also is starting these courses apart from mit pune and there are many more uh, places where on an undergraduate level uh, these courses are being conducted post graduations yes in all the colleges that i have mentioned plus there are a few more colleges where post graduate courses are being conducted uh, it all depends on the individual to be very honest and how how creative he or she is however on an undergraduate level uh, once you pass out from these colleges especially the reputed ones anything between 40 to 70000 rupees per month would be a very uh, safe uh, bet however you do a post graduate course in design the salaries are much higher and even within design there are let us say 15 to 20 uh, different uh, paths you can take so there is one called strategic design management for example which today is design man is actually management in design Uh, which is the highest ranked in terms of uh, career growth um, innovation is another part so if you get into these parts then definitely your salaries could be even more than a lakh per month just to begin with the traits of the student or the child is very easy to notice a person who asks a lot of questions about how things work how things come together and even takes them apart just to find out how everything has come together and how they work for example we call the child destructive if he takes he or she takes apart a doll or a, a, a car for example or a small toy airplane but i i see the positive side of that he, the person is trying to find out how it has come together and that's how their mind starts working another trait is the child keeps sketching not drawing or painting that skill is different but sketching the medium could be anything it could be in sand it could be on back of a paper somewhere but start sketching uh, it could be sketching a particular product for example or maybe uh, an automobile but that's how you would really find out that a person is interested in design uh i would say even making small models of different you know uh, material it could be paper it could be small sticks it could be match sticks it could be toothpicks it could be thermocol for example and all this being done without any of the seniors maybe his elder siblings or his parents or teachers telling him to do it, him or her to do it they doing it on their own so that trait is very very visible i would say even at a, a very young stage to to find out whether you know this person is you know 
inclined towards design. So I would say that all these put together, even one of that would lead the person you know, in, the, in the direction of design.